but not least for this round, we have a digital health platform that solves the problem of storage, access, and mobility of health data. And let's make sure, because give the last picture the same energy and enthusiasm as the first picture. So a big warm welcome for Afia Record. Welcome. Hi, everyone. My name is John Kamara. I'm the founder of Afia Record, and I'm a change maker. And I'm going on an extremely long journey with you. Uh, quick question for you. How many people have their mobile um, financial data with them? If you could just raise your hands real quick. Awesome. I grew up in Ireland, so I also grew up in Europe as well. How many people have their healthcare record? Just raise your hands as well. Just right here with you. In your phone, all the health record you've ever had. How many people? Anybody else? That's all we're doing. We are a deep tech healthcare company, basically solving the problem of access mobility of healthcare data to save the lives of people. Data is the one thing that we produce consistently in healthcare and is the one thing that's been lost nonstop. So we're not infrastructure, resources, all those cool things are solved by other people, but we're just focused on one thing. How do I make sure every healthcare record you have is mobile? As I go back to Dublin now and I'm sick, I'd like my doctors to know all the health record I have from Nairobi, where I just came from, where I came from Ghana, because 33% of people in the world who die basically purely from misdiagnosis on blindsidedness. Doctors are consistently blindsided. And that is in world, first world country. Then think about Africa, where we have limited infrastructure, limited resources, but we produce data all the time. So how do we harness this data to give access to the health infrastructure to provide better healthcare service? That's what we do. And that's what we started to do, especially as the pandemic happened, we realized the value of health data, curated, structured, proper healthcare data in the hands of patients, putting patient at the center of healthcare. The only thing that doesn't move in healthcare is the patient. Everybody else moves, the doctor, the hospital, the infrastructure, they are, the patient is consistent. It's the one person that consistently goes around healthcare. And ultimately, all of you are patients one time or the other. It's just when your journey starts. Some people are patients for a very long time, nonstop, chronic illness patients. 27% of people in the world have chronic illnesses. They have to carry data around with them. Another 7.8% have hereditary illnesses that they're consistently sick. So this is the problem we're trying to solve from a global perspective out of Nairobi. We started in 2020. Uh, we have 170,000 patients on our platform. We also connect the patients to every part of the ecosystem. So the patient is at the center, the hospital, the insurance provider, the research, everybody is connected back to the patient. And this is a world-class platform that we're building out of Kenya. We raised our seed funding uh, to continue our R&D in um, January this year. Uh, and we're now looking to really drive our product into the market because we've tested our alpha test. It works and we can save life. And we actually save the lives of a few people just using data and giving doctors access to that data in real time. That's my pitch. Thank you very much. Thank you. So my first question is for Afia Record. Um, is there any international norm in um, the presentation of the data, of healthcare data, uh, to exchange, uh, to facilitate the, the exchange of the data? Yeah, so basically we, uh, there's fair standards, uh, but one of the important things about data, it comes in different forms. So we're building a, world, a first in the world integration platform that allows our platform to read any form of data that comes from any type of data uh, protocol or any type of facility. So basically you're taking data from every form and you're creating a structure that everybody can read as well. Okay, great. Thank, thank you.